stinky bench. <laughs> It's so windy and it's really cold, but we're at Betty's Bay and we're about to go see the penguins. I see you in the corner. You got all the right moves to turn into the groove all the time. What an honor. It's a show that never ends. The lions in the dead and the land. It's 25 rand to come in per person and it's cash only and we didn't have cash. Yep, we forgot to draw money, but we met the nicest family and they actually just They gave paid us. for us to go in. <laughs> it was, it was that, that, so nice. They are really nice. If you're watching, <laughs> thank you so much. The popular place to go and see penguins is normally Boulder's Beach, closer to Cape Town. And then we found out about Betty's Bay and we thought we'd check it out and we're actually the only people here which is amazing. There were other people here earlier that paid for us to come in and they live ready. <laughs> Unfortunately you can't walk on the beach with the penguins. There's a walkway that you can walk along but there are so many of them. I think we are also going to visit Boulder's Beach and then we'll let you know which one you should come to. having a quick cappuccino here at a restaurant that's very close to where the penguins are and then we'll hit the road again. If you come here to see the penguins, just check the beach first for some penguins because you might see some before you go to the paid entry. But we would still recommend going in and paying the 25 rand. I think I should also just say that the penguins here are very, they, well they look lazy, <laughs> they're not doing much. So on boulders at least you can go on the sand and see them walk and swim. So we're planning to travel along the side of this mountain all the way around. The road is on the cliffs past Gordons Bay and then we're going to get to Cape Town which is over there. So beautiful drive. Along the cliff, scenic road here yeah, from Betty's Bay to Gordon's Bay. <laughs> Here it's good. This drive is amazing so far. Beautiful, beautiful. View. We found the coolest pools and beach here on this drive. You can see behind me the massive pool of the clearest ocean water you'll ever see and down the bottom nice white sand beaches. This drive is definitely worth it. Really really cool. at Gordon's Bay. We've just taken a drive into the little harbour here. Um, the yacht club is behind us. It's really pretty. It's very quiet though. Very, very quiet. We're gonna try and find a place to have some lunch and then carry on with our journey. Very, very windy, but we in Gordon's Bay. We picked up rolls and a bag of chips that's our go-to for a cheap lunch when we travel not the healthiest but the cheapest that's for sure yeah and we're just sitting here under a tree because it's really really hot and the view in front of us is just really really amazing yeah very cool check out the beach Welcome to Gordon's Bay. This is beautiful. The water is so clear. It is 
colder than what we used to. We love the Indian Ocean. This is Atlantic cold vibes. But it's not too bad though. It's going to be worse than Camelot. That's out of the mountain. And we had a nice lunch stop here, and we're very close to our next destination. arrived at the Hippo Boutique Hotel and we're gonna go to reception to check in. Sorry guys, it's very dark. <laughs> okay. We have our parts. We're going up to the top floor. Let's hope our room's nice. Yo. I'm really happy with our place. It's in the middle of Cape Town City and cool little loft, nice view of Signal Hill and Lion's Head to my left here. It's, it's really pretty. The sun's gonna set just behind, I think Lion's Head, that side. But we can go over the mountain to Camps Bay, around the mountain to Greenpoint, and waterfront behind me, that side. We Very can cool. walk down the street. We can walk down the street, there's restaurants and pubs and it's going to be festive. We're in Cape Town! We have arrived in Cape Town and the weather is perfect. So we went through booking.com this time, we're in the Hippo Boutique Hotel and we booked this loft apartment and it is amazing. And we got a nice view of Signal Hill and Lion's Head. So it's very cool. I'm very happy. I don't know about you. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> this is awesome. This is going to be home for the next four nights. So we unpacked all of our stuff. We've already been for a swim in the pool. We're going to walk now to Long Street and Clough Street, which are the main streets with all the restaurants and pubs and stuff. So we're going to look for something to eat and just check the surroundings. Yeah, we're staying in the middle of town, just off Kloof Street, which connects with Long Street. All the towns we've been so far has been so quiet. Yeah. So to actually see people is going to be really nice. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> Yay, guys. We're so excited to show you Cape Town. Yes, sir. Um, you studied here. Yeah. I've been here maybe two or three times before, twice with you for a wedding. So I want to show Chantal all the best places because I lived here for four years while studying and I loved every second of it. Cape Town is a beautiful place. So. Yes. So if you want to come along for our South African road trip, then please hit that subscribe button. So let's go check out Cape Town. Let's go. Let's go. So we just walked into the old biscuit mill. Don't judge me, we're on holiday. <laughs> they have flavors from all over the world. Atlantic is freezing! The Atlantic Ocean is tame on your 